Hey guys, Frankie and Irv, CigarNews.com, here at IPCPR. We're here with Cantella Cigars. We got Michael and Cantelli. Cantelli. Yeah. Michael and Rich. And uh, just lit this thing up. This thing's amazing. I want these guys to talk more about it, but I'm going to throw it over to Irv. Just let him ask a question. So, guys, tell me uh, what got you into this uh, tobacco industry? Well, it's always uh, been a passion of mine. Um, I was an artist for most of my life and just always loved cigars and uh, something I've wanted to do for a lot of years. And I've always looked at cigars as kind of an art form. You can see our, our slogan here is the art of cigars. No day is our line. Always wanted to do it and um, hooked up with Rich over here, my partner. Uh, we've traveled extensively doing another business together and he's a sales monster. And um, I had a lot of the concept and everything put together and I needed someone to team up with. So. Rich came in and he was the other piece of the puzzle. So, so, so he's the muscle, I, huh? Yeah, my wife and I were on the third party. She couldn't be here. And it's something, cold we always, yeah, something we always wanted to do, and Rich was that, that third piece of the puzzle we needed to launch this, and it's, uh, we're just flying ever since Richie came in a picture. Yeah, it's good. Sounds real good. Let's talk about the cigar. Yeah, let's talk about the cigar. This is, uh, what size is this one? This is a, it's a I, I call it a shorty, it's a 4x50. Four by 50. Four by this 50. is actually not introduced yet. Um, okay. It's basically a shortened version of our Robusto. Um, I got this cigar really for me because I smoke based on how much time I have. And I don't usually get an hour or so to smoke a cigar, I'll get 15 or 20 minutes. So I just love these short cigars. So I came out with this for myself and then we started using it as samples. Everybody loves it. So we're going to introduce this four inch size because it's a big hit for us. Everyone loves this short cigar because you can smoke it you know, a reasonable amount of time. Oh, it's great. And, you know, it's great. You know, with it. Tell us the history behind the company, you guys. This is an exclusive. Tell us. Well, again, you know, um, I've always wanted to do it. And Catelli, obviously, half Catalano, half Ionelli. So that's your, that's your last name? Yeah, Catalano, Catalano Ionelli. 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 And, and uh, something I always wanted to do, and I met Avi Sosa years ago. And uh, I wanted to do this you know, way back when, and uh, I re-approached him after Rich and I started talking. You know, we had a conversation in a hotel one night. I told him I was thinking about doing this cigar business, because we always smoke cigars on the road, you know? And I said, uh, I said, I got this one-page business plan, why don't you take a look at it? We put it down on the table in the hotel room, and he goes, I'm in. <laughs> nice, nice. And here we are. That was, that was literally, what, four or five months ago, maybe? Um, We've hit the ground running. So anyways, I went back to Abby. I said, I'm ready to do this. And we started we started going through the samples. And uh, Abby worked with us. He's just gone really. He's been a great asset for us because he got us exactly what we wanted for our blend. We got the consistency we wanted. We got the quality of the social family behind us. We couldn't be happy. So, so question for you real quick. Tell me about the, because uh, you designed the box. You made the box. Yeah, you know, again, my art, my art days, um, I did the drawings. I designed the box. Uh, you can see the drawings are on the sign here. Um, obviously, you know, the, the shape of the girls go with the shape of the, the cigars and just something we did to catch the eye. You know, when you go into the humidor, we hope that this catches the eye and then the cigars do the rest. And the cigars speak for themselves. This is kind of a little eye catcher, you know. Out of cool. and that's not printed, that's actually burned into the wood. Yeah, this is a great friend of ours. Uh, can I plug him? Tom over at uh, uh, Personalized Experts in uh, Book Raton. Great guy, he happens to be our neighbor at our warehouse and he lays a burn this in here. He does a phenomenal job. He did our sign, he does everything for us. He's a great neighbor to have, a great guy. Thank you. So, yeah, so I feed him the artwork and he burns it. Now he, already, he also designed our other box, which at the beginning we were thinking of, of course, cost efficient, cost of saving the customer money, doing this, doing that. Well, those are beautiful. And as we were uh, you know, going around sampling to the stores, all of a sudden, we started seeing the boxes, got a couple more ideas. Michael said, you know what? We're going to come out with another box, and I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it myself. Now we have two beautiful boxes, one for in, one for servicing. It's, it's just everything has fallen perfectly into place. Awesome. The whole business uh, network is just locked in. Yeah, this is years in the making. Yeah, it's years in the making of planning this. And again, you know, we finally actually got to put it into play, but because we've been planning it for so long, 
we just had a stock joint, it, so it's really been great. Let, let, let me say this: this thing is absolutely amazing. It's, Obviously, it's, my, it's, my first stick. It's everything I could ever ask for in a cigar. Now, this is the Modelo because yep, it's Modella. Modella. because of the model. Modella. Means model. Yep. Now, like, explain to me uh, your wrapper, your binder, and your filler. Sure. You got going it's on here. an Ecuadorian Habano Sun Grown wrapper, uh, Nicaraguan binder and filler. Uh, it's uh, it's it's just a sweet medium, very, very consistent cigar. Very consistent. You know, one thing I, when I went and started working with Avi, I said, I said, you know, I smoke based on time. And although I want everything from this little cigar up to a 6x60, I want it always to taste consistent. Because I don't want to switch sizes and switch flavors. And, uh, you know, it took some time. We worked together on it. And uh, I got exactly what I wanted. So no matter which one of these cigars I grab, I know it's going to have the same great sweet taste. It's very, very well balanced. Thank you very I've, much. We've had so many compliments, comments on how somebody who loves the bigger cigar, obviously the Toro, the Torpedo, doesn't have the time like you said, but you know, on a golf course especially, I've seen where guys are wasting cigarettes, you know, they're smoking them, they get to the end, they throw it out. Well, you can smoke a full size, first nine, you know, you come to the end, pull out a Robusto, right to the end, you smoke two beautiful cigars, Burn the same, taste the same. I mean, people are really, really on board with this. Right now. So, very well. So, Rich, t tell me a little bit. How'd you get connected with this whole thing? Bottom line is, um, I, I it actually started from playing golf. I learned to play golf three, four years ago from my other businesses. I have a couple other businesses, and uh, I got to playing golf. Everybody was smoking a cigar, uh, okay. whether in the clubhouse, outside. Friends that, that I have in businesses are always talking about, come over now, smoke a cigar. With me. I never smoked a cigarette in my life. I said, well, this is pretty neat, and started doing it. Then all of a sudden, Michael and I started traveling. He's coming out with these cigars that he has literally had for years that were as, as perfect as walking into a store and buying it that day. So one day I said, how? This thing's from 2002. How's it take? Come to my house one day. I have something I want to talk to you about. Once I saw his passion, his knowledge, what he did with a room and turned it into a giant humidor is what it comes down to. He, we are truly total opposites and you talk about how opposites attract everything i do michael doesn't either like him to do it and everything he does i don't have the patience for it and we just like he said he said you know let's do something together i have a great idea and he came out with this list of what it would take i got halfway down and my mind was already because of my networking i'm, I'm thinking cigars great cigar golf courses, restaurants, bars. I'm in all of them. I do it all over the world, all over the country. This is a no-brainer for me. I'll do it. Where I'm in. And he didn't even get it. He kept on going. And really, well, let me show you another real good thing. I said, I'm in. And if you went down here and looked, I said, I'm in. You're in? We're in. And here we are in front of you guys. And it's been, it's like a, it's, I call it the magic carpet ride. That's we have literally yeah. been in business with cigars since June 1st. So. June 1st. June 1st. So two June months, two, two days. Exclusive, and, exclusive. And, and literally, the day when we say June 1st, we didn't just start making phone calls and say we have June 1st cigars started going into retailers. Yeah. Wow. Cigars wow. immediately. It was awesome. just like that. And, uh, just the feedback fantastic. has been tremendous. Fantastic. So, so how, how can the customers, how can they find you? Where's your website? Well, CatelliCigars.com. Okay. Uh, they can go to our website, and it's, it's a new site. We're working on it. We're spending most of our time with the, with the cigars. We need to spend more time on the site, but you can go there. Um, we've got a handful of retailers. This is our debut. Hopefully, when we leave the show, we'll have a bunch more. Um, but, you know, they, you can reach us through the website. If somebody wants to know where to get them, and they're not finding anything near them on our site, we can, we can guide them. Okay. Great. You know, Great. And, and bear with us, because over time, we're just going to spread, you know, further and further. But... If, they, if you want us guys, we'll get them to you. You know, what it, you know, it just keeps on going. Every day we get something more to build on. And I have to say to you guys, not because you're doing this for us, but yes, because of who you are and what you're doing out there. For not just us, not just Catelli Cigars, but for the other distributors, wholesalers, retailers. If it isn't for people like you, we can't get half done what we're getting done. And the fact that you guys are with us, and I'll call you family now because you literally came in on the ground floor and did this for us within two months. We can look back on this in two years and say it was because of you guys doing this very for us. Cool. Thank you very much. And this is what it's all about. Yeah, I want to yeah. thank, thank you. Very I want to thank you. It's an honor, man. It's an honor. No, it's, it's an honor. An honor. Irv, it's good Italian man right there. Trust me. Michael, congratulations. Thank you very much. Bye. Thanks, man. I'll put it over there. Thank you. Thank you.
All right, guys, this is Frankie and Irv, CigarNews.com. We'll get these guys plugged in. We're going to get these guys on our show, the Thursday night show from 8 o'clock to 9 o'clock Central Standard Time. We'll get them booked, and we'll let you know when that's coming. Thanks, guys.